All right, going into game one right here. And we got the AK Princess, AK Bestness. Button check? Button check? Yeah, button okay, check. So. All right, yeah, definitely. Why would uh, anyone pick Omega Battlefield? Like the uh, little, the little, sw little swiggly right in the center. Yeah, the, the spiral thing. I don't know what that is about. Yeah. Ooh, best mess gets the first stock with that frozen uh, SD. <laughs> All right, Ooh, buns are checked. Best, best Let's get in. Forfeits that match. It's gonna cost him. We're taking it to Starterville. All right, game one. Let's go. Mario's a uh, combo breaker, signature move. Mm -hmm. Really good. Up there, up there. Nope. He's just kicking him back down. Ooh, oh wow, that was really good. That really built up the damage, wow. Fireball approach, pretty good. Neutral. Board air got him. Ooh, best nest takes the first stock. In my honest opinion, though, Peach is severely over, like underrated. Like no one's representing her, her at all, like in any tournament. Yeah. I mean, don't get me wrong. Like I know Peach is really good. It's just there are certain characters where I don't want to respect them because I just hate them. Oh yeah. And Sonic's one of them. Yeah. Game and Watch is one of them. And Peach is definitely that. one of them, but so she's really good. She definitely as you can see right here with Best with Best and S using her, she definitely has a lot of combo. Yeah. Oh Ooh. Best and S takes the first game. Game goal. Yes. Uh, where is it? And they're going back to Smashville, all right. Ooh, Frozen has a Mega Man, all right, this is interesting. Lemons, lemons, lemons. It's actually his uh, strategy in uh, Kurogane Hammer. Place where you go to see all the frame data and stuff. I really like Mega Man's aerial mobility. Like he just like flies through the air. It's pretty good. Right. Saw drop. Didn't get anything off of it though, unfortunately. Oh, he stopped Peach and Strap. Yeah, definitely. That was a tennis racket. Peach is just so good on like keeping the pressure on you and then keeping the pressure off of herself with uh, her counter. And just her overall floatiness, like she can just get away from anything really. Alright, Mr. Saturn in play. Ooh, and there you have it. The shield break. <laughs> Going for the style. Oh, and he's still keeping on to Mr. Saturn. And he gets it again. This is 
disrespect. Just, just forward smash him. There you go. Off to. Oh, shit. I think Frozen definitely should have held on to that. Hopefully, he should have freaked on that. That crown. Or actually, the most that's a mistake in game two. Smash it again. And two Johns just not having to smash four legs. <laughs> Oh wow. Best miss getting a pretty sick combo off of those down tilts. Forward air. Ooh. Don't understand why Frozen keeps uh, changing characters. Or, uh, he pretty much mains Mario. I don't know. They're, they, they train together, so. This is really not making sense to me. Back air, trade. Oh, smash. Frozen gets the first stock off on best mess. That was actually a really interesting mix-up done by Frozen. They're just going for the normal uh, hoo-ha. Not for the. I'm not sure if that was down throw. Or no, it was up throw. That's nice. Oh, Sure, actually. I think it's uh, one of those instances where both characters are good at camping. It's just a matter of uh, who can camp better. No, no, no offense to anything, though. No, it's just the strategy around the character. But Frozen definitely plays a more aggro Rob than I've seen most others play. But they're totally goofing right now. A smash. Uh, 
at that. Best miss. Alright, okay, I see it. Yeah, so you know this is, this is fine as well. Yeah. 
What color ports are you guys? <laughs> Yeah.